Yo guys, this is your boy BT Riser. Yes, I'm back with the next video. Yes, but today I'm really going to get really deep. I'm going to go in the Bible today. So, let's get into it. Yeah, 360 in the contract. Never that. I just take the contact. I bring it back. I'm running on the fast break behind the back. Yeah, this that, this that, this that penny with yeah. the shack. Hey guys, this is your boy BT Rice and welcome back to my channel. If you're here for the first time, thank you for watching because I want to really share some encouraging stuff from the Word of God and I really want to help you through the weekend because I know how things could seem and you'd be looking for something really good but it's not there but God is always working it out for you. Okay, remember that. Okay, Exodus chapter 15 verse 2. The Lord is my strength and my song and he has become my salvation. No matter how things seem guys, God is always making something happen for you and no matter how hard it seem, God, you can always run to God and God is always working it out like literally working it out for you. No matter what people will say, God is working it out. No matter how hard things seem, God is working it out. You could go in the presence of God and call on his name. Sit down with him and talk to him. Tell God how you feel because I know how things seem, guys. I know how things seem because I know the God days that you want to cry. You have no money. You have no food in the cupboard. But God is always working it out. God is always finding a way for you to get something to eat. He wake you up and send you to your job on mornings. Because God is always your strength. Because he's going to help you. When you've done something really bad. God is there to help you up. Like help you up. No matter, how, no matter what you did. You have messed up, but God is there to help you up. In all this I'm saying, guys, God is here for you. No matter who you are, God is there for you to help you through the darkest times, okay? Remember that. And I got this next one that you guys should feel encouraged about. Um, Psalm 27 verse 14. Wait for the Lord and be strong and take heart and, and, and wait for the Lord. I'm going to read that again. Wait for the Lord. Be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. Reason being, God is God has something coming for you. Like, like this, that special thing, that special someone, that special gift, or that special job. God is working it out. Like, he's like making a way for you guys. Because I know how things seem that time. Because you're looking for that paycheck and you're not having it. And you want to pay that bill and you're not seeing it. But God is always making it out. Like making it making it happen. Literally happen because you want to be like, okay, I need this money to come like no Lord because I am struggling. I know how things see you guys. But I just want you to remember you are an awesome person and God is gonna make it for you. Make it through. You could call on God anytime, no matter how hard it seems, guys. Let me straight up. God is going to make it up for you. God's going to make it happen each and every minute of your life. You're going to jump for joy. No matter how much tears you have cried, right? God is going to make it for you. God is going to hold on to you and tell you that everything's going to be okay. You're gonna you may cry many nights, right? But God is there fighting for you guys. He helped you to get up on mornings and send you off to work to help you to make meet, meet, meet ends meet for your kids and help you to get through. No one is perfect, but I remember this. I want you guys to never give up in this time, okay? Remember to strive for excellence in the presence of God. You might not be a Christian. But God loves you no matter what. If you grow up in a Christian family, that's okay. that's okay. God still loves you no matter what. You could be a drinker or a smoker, no matter what. God loves you no matter what. Remember this, guys. Keep walking forward because God has your back 24-7. Remember that. Call on God. Say a little prayer and God will answer your call. If you want to know him. Just tell God, help me to understand you more, God. 
ask God to just be there to help you through every situation in your life. If you want to know God, ask God to come into your heart. Help me to be a new person. Help me to be better in you, God. No matter how things seem, guys, God is going to answer your call and he's going to hear you. Remember that, okay? If you need me to pray for you guys, leave, leave, it, leave it in the comment. I will say a prayer for you guys. I promise you I will say a prayer for you guys. No matter what it is, no matter who you are, I will pray for you. And thank you guys for watching because I just want to share this devotion with you because I hope that was an encouragement for you guys and to help you through the week because I know how things seem, okay? Remember, God loves you. And thank you for watching. Hit like and subscribe. Thank you guys because... You guys have been a great family and I love you guys out there. I'm praying for you guys out there and never give up. Thank you for watching. Oh, AK, AK, that's how my tongue's break. Love is my clipping. Y'all gotta be my gun range. I'm like, he's coming back. Oh.